Also, so I freed, or I imprisoned Arian Lovellette before. So I assume I might be able to find him in here somewhere. So where are they going? That door feels important if they're if there's a whole cutscene about it, so. It might be worth going in there. Ah. It's Arian Lavalette. So he's, he's also trying to escape. Come on, mate. Please stay calm, Arian. What are you doing here? Uh, same as him, escaping. Yes, but they imprisoned you. Why? They say I killed Voldest. Shame. I'd hope to do that myself. Do you know my mother's fate? Voltest did her no harm. Um. I think he gave her protection. Voltest ordered the blue stripes to guard her like some invaluable treasure. Bastard. Placing her among those dogs. One more nobly born should protect her. A baronet at least. Yeah, but they're probably not as good at protecting compared to the blue stripes. Because they're, they're. The blue stripes are the elite what unit, I think. Not your concern. We must get to the oil store where there's a way out. I'm weak. You must help me. Must I? I mean, it's for a quest, so. See, he's threatening to to cool people here. Um, so that's the door that was part of the cutscene. I assume. That's what, that staircase is going to be the way out. So I can search that body. Also, I could see someone peering through this door. Bastard! You fucking prick! Fuck you, cocksucker! Fuck you up the arse! That's very nice. Motherfucker! I have no idea who that is. Fucking killed you, hear me? Oh, you prick off and beat your head in with it! I mean, if he was being nicer, I might have let him out, but not if he's going to be like that. Oh, so there's people here. Ooh, he's got a glowing sword. Um, I can take his mind. I think. And then whack him when he's not expecting it. Ouch. Let's try blasting him like that. Okay, I think that's how I'm supposed to get rid of shields and stuff, is blast them with that. Because that seemed to work fairly well. He's just hiding behind his shield, which is rude. There we go. Can I have the glowing sword, please? I would very much like a glowing sword. Uh... That's pretty good armour, so I will take that. So what have I got? Armour. Let's put some boots on, some better gauntlets, and some trousers. And I assume because we're in an armoury, there's going to be all sorts of weapons to pick up. Uh, I found a weapon upgrade. Use this item, use this item to boost the statistics of a weapon. So I need to go into inventory, then choose the upgrade and the weapon I wish to improve. Um, also, there's a whole lot of stuff in here, in the torturer's chamber. Uh, a diagram for a chlora. So I think that's a type of trap that I can now craft when I'm in a slightly safer location. Because I don't really want to sit here and do that when I'm simply helping... Well, I need to escape, and also Arian needs to escape. Um... Right. I thought there was a secret in here somewhere, but apparently not. So there's a thing, that's just a torch. There is a way up here, or a way down, but I can't get up there. So let's just carry on. So, what do I need to do? I need to help Arian get through. So I need to get rid of the guards on the way to the exit. Okay. 
That I can do. I'm going to try Axie again. So that makes it so he can't hear me. Or see me. But he's still trying to fight someone. Or is he attacking his friends? Ow. Someone came from behind me. So yeah, because I mind wiped him. He attacked his friends. But it ended too early. But there we go. And he's the last one left, so... Let's burn him alive. Feels a bit mean, but... Uh... Oh, now instead of fighting, I'm looting. That's very odd. Yeah, some bits of the game are a little buggy. But that's fine. Because it is a very good game. Right. So I've gotten rid of all the guards, I think. No, I'm trying to loot, not turn lights on enough. Um, I mean, I can't... Oh, there's one red dot on the map, so I assume that's the final guard. There's also a chest. One leather gauntlet. So I already have some of those. Right. So now I need to go back and get Arian and help him escape. Because, I mean, I let him live. So I assume he's going to help me and not shout for the guards and all that. But I don't know where these guards keep coming from because I've cleared out the whole of this way. Although I guess that was there was the one door that I didn't help me up. that I didn't go through. Right, let's carry him through. Up the stairs, this way. I I know where to go. I've just cleared out all the guards from here. But this is very, very slow. There is still some loot here, but I door on the left. That's can't grab that. Okay, so that's the first door, which looks like the same room, but the door's shut. So, so I don't know why he wants the oil store. I'm sure it's. I I don't. I think he's going to do something bad with it. Ooh. A secret way out. Come with me. There's nothing you can do here. I've more to do now than ever before. Alone. I need no one's aid for what I aim to accomplish. Is that your final word? Farewell, Witcher. He's gonna blow the place up with all the oil. And he's gonna blow himself up. Because he's very sane. Yeah, I don't think he survived for some reason. Also, there's a new sword. I will take a sword. Because that does twice as much damage as my current weapon. So I guess we need to... I think Rote said he was sailing up river. So I think we need to get to a boat. If we can survive the guards. Halt! Blimey, is that you, Witcher? They say you I'm going to prove it. I'm inclined to believe you. I'm glad to hear that. It'd be pretty stupid if I had to kill you now. Did all the Reavers survive the assault? Aye. They've been drinking themselves silly for two days now. I believe I owe you something. You don't owe me a thing. We wound up in a boiling cauldron during the assault. You know how it is when knights get caught in a tight passage. Nowhere to go. Those in the back push forward. Those in the front are stuck. And halberd blows raining down from above. I'd have been crushed if not for my armor, and about ten blows landed on my helmet. My ears still ring, and I puke time and again, but I live and breathe. Concussion. Well, it's good that we talk into our armor then, rather than going in in just his normal clothes. Um, the Squirtle ambush. They had masks made of the cloth of special forces uniforms, and they hollered a lot, Yorva or some such. So Yorva's going to be their leader. Where did the dragon come from? I've no idea, but it saved our asses. The elves ceased shooting at the sight of it. Can't tell you anymore, as we fled right then as if the devil himself was on our tail. Take this. Kenneth told me to study up, and I'm not the mind for it. 
Just not cut out to be a dragon hunter, I guess. It could be useful to you, though. I need to go. There so, am I going to have to no hunt dragons? Can you distract me? Um, I'll try. But remember, count me out if there's a fight. In fact, we could end up foes. I hope not. Go. Just okay, so me. he's going to distract them for me so I can sneak by. So, while he's doing that, I'll loot some stuff. So there's the guards that I need to bypass. The King's but we need to the whole the castle is on fire. All right. Let's go. right. While they while they move, let's go and loot some stuff. Um, is there going to be stuff down there to loot? So that is Triss waiting for me. So I assume that's where I need to go. Um, but there's nothing else down here. And that should be enough time for them to move out the way, so... Geralt, over here. Yeah, but I want to loot the stuff. I can loot the stuff quickly, and then we go. So I think we've just survived not only a fight, but survived the dungeons as well. Um, I don't know if I get all my stuff back from before. I, I doubt it. But I've got another level up. The you would sneak out, avoid anything resembling a bloodbath. You left me the key to my manacles, not an invisibility cloak. Triss, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. We'll find the Kingslayer and clear our names. People say what they think they have to. I know, but... They'll change their minds as soon as we find the Kingslayer. Roach will see to that. Right, spy? I'm no spy, but you're mostly correct. Aren't you a spy? The Interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel ruled Temeria now. Or strived. But no one save old Natalis can restore true order. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown's simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand... Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago, I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. I guess that's where we're heading. Yes. A bit beta. Have you seen his back? Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Prepare to cast off. Clear the lines and all aboard. Lines clear, Captain. Well, I guess we leave this place behind in search of the square tail of Dwarveth and the bold assassin in Flotsam. Honor's a curious thing. Honor made Arian fight a mismatched battle against the might of Temeria. Facing defeat, Honor told Arian to bow his neck to save his men. But that same honor prevented him from saving himself. Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known the Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, 
As water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with a sorceress named Jennifer. Stories of a life stolen from him. Am I boring you? Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special's about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. <laughs>